This week has been challenging for the Hemet community. Postings and comments made against our schools have left the community in a restless state, full of unease and increased fear. We are dedicated to providing a safe learning environment for our students and individuals that seek to harm or create fear and anxiety against our schools will be handled swiftly and appropriately. I want to ensure our families that every piece of information we receive in regards to the risk of student and staff safety is taken very seriously. Every threat, regardless of credibility, is handled the same. We follow the same procedures because we believe you can never be too cautious when it comes to student safety. We are taking several steps to enhance existing safety and security programs here at the district. We are utilizing Spragio as a means for anyone to submit an anonymous tip to the district. Since the beginning of the school year, we have received 296 tips regarding bullying and threats or pranks against school sites. We recently implemented Hour Zero, an all hazards management software district-wide. This software organizes all of our emergency responses and drills in a central location to ensure all of our sites are prepared for any number of emergencies. We have created and hired for a director of security who is reviewing a number of security concepts. He has already begun working on several specific initiatives, such as increasing and improving surveillance camera systems, implementing electronic locks capable of locking down in an emergency, the use of reinforced window film and metal detectors, enhancing our campus supervision program, and developing a district-wide active shooter training program. In addition, we are reviewing district policies to ensure we are using the best safety practices in all areas of school operations. It has almost been a month since the Parkland, Florida school tragedy, and it continues to weigh heavily on our hearts. It has left our schools, community, and nation heartbroken as we think about the many lives lost and the families that have been affected. During this time, a nationwide conversation about preventative safety measures has begun. Understandably, these important conversations can create emotional and political debates, and there are calls for a school walkout nationwide on March 14th and April 20th. We want families to know that while students can exercise their freedom of speech rights, they cannot disrupt instruction. If a student chooses to leave campus for the demonstration period, regular absence and discipline procedures will apply. We understand that some students may want to participate in these demonstrations, while some may not. Our goal as a district is to ensure that all students feel safe, supported, and respected as they grapple with these issues. Site staff are working with student leaders to develop alternative avenues in which students can express their viewpoints and engage in constructive dialogue while remaining on campus, where we can ensure their safety. I want to thank our students, families, and staff for their efforts in ensuring the safety of our campuses these last couple of weeks. As we move forward, I believe our collaboration will ensure that Hemet Unified meets its aspirational goal of becoming the premier school district. And I would also like to remind our community, our students, and our staff to remember if you see something, say something.